and has changed my life. Uh, and I just, I needed to share it with you all. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Erica and I make videos all about bags. So a few things before we get started into this video, guys. One, um, I still have a few more bags open or available on my Poshmark. So if you wanna go check that out, I will leave my Poshmark closet link in the description box down below. Two, a lot of you have come up with amazing like questions about my water bottles um, ever since my get to know me video or my interest in my skincare, or just different things. And I think what I'm gonna start doing guys is I'm gonna release a second video each week um, non-related to bags. So I'll just do things on skincare care on water bottles on um, just like maybe a day in my life actually this coming weekend I am redoing a table I have never redone a piece of furniture ever uh, this so this could be a really fun little journey and um, I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride so that's gonna be something in the works that I will be adding a second video to my rotation but Thursdays will always be dedicated to bags because that is the first and foremost reason for this channel is handbags I have just decided that it could be a really fun idea to add that to the rotation and hopefully you guys like it as well. But on to this video. I am so excited to make this one for you guys because this is something that DJ purchased for me. Um, a lot of you have given me amazing bag suggestions in the comments and I have checked out every single one that you guys suggested and I literally have a list together for myself post move of all the things I want to check out and possibly buy. Um, but with that, I told you guys that I would not be buying myself a new bag during this move process. Um, and actually, like I gave you my Poshmark, I'm kind of doing not only the opposite of buying new bags, I am rehoming a lot of, well, not a lot, but some of the bags in my collection that just really don't get the use anymore. So I've done a lot of that and I've actually stayed true to my promise. I have not bought myself any bags, but it doesn't mean that I'm not looking, right? So um, Longchamp had this amazing sale. Uh, I don't know if this is like an annual sale that they do. This is the first time I've ever shopped directly from Longchamp site and um, the prices were phenomenal. And I've mentioned before that I was really in the market for like a silver or metallic bag and Longchamp had these amazing silver bags. So I showed DJ and DJ actually surprised me and went and purchased the bag that I was looking Looking at uh, in the silver color so I'm so excited so let's just get into the bag okay guys this is the bag it is a Longchamp Le Pliage Neo bag in a large size it is the silver color and a few things about the Neo bag guys that I want to share with you so first uh, again this bag is in the silver the Neos are a little bit different than the normal Le Pliage line, and this is how they differ. First, the Le Pliage are inspired, it's inspired by origami, which means that it does fold. The Neo bags do not fold, although they will remain flat when empty. They don't have the buttons on the back like the normal Le Pliage bags that you'll usually see here, uh, because they don't go into a smaller bag for storage. They will, again, just fold flat. Another part of the Neo line that makes it a little bit different is the fact that the trimmings and then the nylon color are the same versus the Le Pliage line where they are generally juxtaposed, where that trimming is uh, generally a brown color while the nylon is a different color. Um, so with these bags, it is the same. So it's the silver trim uh, with the silver nylon. Um, the Neo bags also have a thicker nylon material, so it makes it for those you know edges on the side. They don't wear as quickly, um, or they're it's just more durable than the regular Le Pliage line. And then another differing thing is the zipper. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but the zipper is like a harder plastic um, versus the Le Pliage zipper. And I love the zipper. I think it's a really easy, smooth zipper to kind of get in and out of. And then last. Lastly, something that makes this bag a little different is that it does have the option for these smaller handles and then it has this detachable crossbody strap which I will model for you right now so you can see it uh, on a 5.5 frame. So obviously guys, the pro to having this bag is the crossbody strap, at least in my opinion, as I love crossbody bags. However, what I will say about this, um, where it is a pro, it is also a con, because this bag 
crossbody strap is not adjustable. So while I love the uh, where it lays for my 5'5 five five frame, um, somebody who might be taller or shorter may not like how it sits on them. So that is something to keep in mind that it's not adjustable. So that's uh, kind of disappointing, but um, at the end of the day, I really love the strap. It's very, very comfortable. And when I wear it, I don't find that it digs into my shoulders. And also guys, I carry a lot in this bag um, and the weight distribution is just really awesome and I don't find that even packed full I, this bag creates any shoulder pain or anything like that so any of you looking for like the lighter bag and lighter to carry the long shot bags may be something to really look into because they're just so light and like I said even full the weight distribution with the crossbody strap is just spot on it's very very comfortable so um I really love it for that reason so let's get into uh the dimensions really fast before we get into the bag so this bag is 15.7 inches wide it has a 7 inch depth so it's super deep and it's got a 12.2 inch height so it's definitely a bigger bag so guys, you all know I've been on a small bag journey and I've definitely been carrying uh, bags much smaller than this one. However, um, this bag does carry my 15 inch laptop. I know for a lot of the videos I demonstrate with a 13 inch laptop um, just because I think 13 inches is just a uh, more of an average computer size. However, um, for my editing and a lot of my computer needs, I use my 15 inch laptop and I have a kind of a bigger case on it. And a lot of my bags do not carry that. I have a Herschel supply bag, which I will link that video down below for you. Um, that does carry it. And I love that bag, but the one thing that that bag doesn't have that this one does is a crossbody strap. So I love that this one has it. And also a tidbit for you guys is that, um, my new house will not have near the internet that this one does, meaning I will have to take my computer far more, um, just to upload in different places versus my house, because the uploading is just going to be like next to null. So please don't think that anything's going to change with the uploading on my videos. It is not. They will remain um, definitely that Thursday schedule and those additional videos. However, um, I'm just going to have to upload in different locations, meaning that this bag is definitely going to be coming into even more handy when I need uh, to take my computer, you know, somewhere. So that will be something uh, that this bag will get even more use for uh, later down the road because it does carry the computer. But I'm almost more excited than the bag. I love this bag. I have got to show you the inside simply because the accessory I've purchased for this bag that I think I, I will never not have this in any other bag going forward is something that I'm just so thrilled with and has changed my life. Uh, and I just, I needed to share it with you. I almost made it its own video, but I really just wanted to show you the new bag that DJ got me. So, and he watches my channel. So this was something that he's like, are you gonna make a video? Of course. So let's just get into it. So first, let me just kind of show you the inside. The inside is kind of like, um, uh, like a nylon sort of fabric. It's like, um, it's like wipeable. So if anything like spills in the bag, it's not, it's like waterproof and you just sort of wipe it up and there won't be any staining, which I really like. So that is kind of nice. So this guys is my 15 inch laptop in like what looks like an old bookcase. So I really love that like look to this, but it definitely adds some bulk, uh, to the size of it. And this whole thing fits in the bag and then it zips up fine. So that's a really nice thing to have. So let me show you really quick what it looks like without the laptop. So you have that and this is what I want to show you guys. So without my little insert in the bag, the bag goes like really flat. Also just so you see what I've put on this bag, this is a little poof that I got from Bath and Body Works and it has hand sanitizer on it. I just thought it went really well. And then it has, I have like a little like crystal E on here um, that I've also put on. So that is the bag with nothing in it. Uh, it does have one inside compartment that is just really tiny. And honestly, guys, I just keep the little bag with my energy stones in here and that's just tucked away quite nicely. Um, and that's pretty much everything in the bag. But this is what I really wanted to show you. This is my new bag organizational insert. I purchased this when this bag came in the mail and he surprised me with it. I immediately went on to Amazon and I searched 
bag organizers because guys I've had a Longchamp Le Pliage bag before I've had it in the Cure um, and that bag is phenomenal but it is huge and I find that these bags um, they don't really hold their shape so I wanted something that would give the bag its shape and I kind of went back and forth with just putting a like kind of harder piece of like cardboard in the bottom um, that just kind of I cut out to like match the size and then using pouches or doing something like a bag organizer. Now I have never had a bag organizer before which may be kind of crazy considering how many bags I've, I've owned um, and just how much I've loved them. I've seen these all over the place. I'm not unfamiliar with bag organizers. I've known about them for a very long time. I just never decided, I, I just never thought about buying one until that came. I really just wanted to give the bag shape. So this, this, guys, it is the best thing that's ever happened to me. I didn't know I needed one. Um, this holds everything I need. It is very, the, the organizer itself is extremely lightweight. This is in the large size. I will link uh, the Amazon site or the Amazon page down below uh, where I found this. This was, I think, like $23. The color in this particular size and this particular color, for whatever reason, this is the light pink color, was uh, cheaper than the other colors. I wanted this color. I didn't buy it for the fact that it was cheaper, but was it a bonus? Most definitely. But they come in all different kind of sizes, all different colors, and I think for every bag going forward, if I can find it in a, in a size that it will fit that bag, I am going to buy one. I intend on having every single one in that size. Now guys, again, this is a large. I considered the X large because the X large probably would have fit in that bag. It will also fit the Louis Vuitton GM bags, the X large will. However, I did look at the Amazon comments and for the Le Pliage large totes, a lot of people said they went ahead and just went with the large size. So I kind of went around with like what people's comments were saying and I'm pleased that I did. Um, because I find that it's just, it's a good size and I love it. So let's just kind of go over the organizer. I don't really want to go into everything that I carry because it, again, it's really not a what's my bag. So the front pocket is just kind of like a slip pocket and it's huge. I don't have anything in here. And then on the other side, there's that kind of same size of the other slip pocket, but it's divided. So I have chapsticks in one, pens in another, and then I have like my mints and my photo clicker in here and then on the inside, you see these like three divots that can also come out and it's totally detachable from the organizer. So if you do not want this in here, um, you can just take it out and it can be one giant compartment like so. But I think it's nicer to keep those things organized um, into that little triple section. So yes, guys, I like to keep that little insert in here rather than have it as like one big main compartment. Um, as I like to organize it with like my coin purse, my wallet. These are kind of like, a, it's like a body lotion, it's perfume, sunglasses, and my flint roller. This is kind of like my little extra pack of just like, you know, body care stuff. Um, and yeah, so the, I have like my agenda, my Kindle, and uh, a book in one side, and then I keep kind of like just the uh, bills I need on the other. So this organizer has been fantastic. I absolutely love it. I cannot speak highly enough about it. So you guys see then what this bag looks like without it. It's very, um, it doesn't really have a shape. It kind of goes all over the place. And this is the bag with the organizer, guys. So it just gives it such a nice shape. I love that with the organizer in it, it keeps its shape. And when I go to reach into this bag, guys, everything I need is right in its spot. I absolutely, I, I cannot get enough of the organizer. Um, and it's basically the whole point of this video is to show you guys this phenomenal organizer that you can use with so many different totes. So yeah, guys, I, I just really wanted to show you that organizer. I just think it's so fun. Um, I, like I said, are they new to the market absolutely not i'm just late on the train of the bag organizers and i will never not have one this it's literally changed the purse game um and it just has kept me so organized i generally like and go to like pouches as my way of organizing my bags I, this <laughs> game changer i just don't know if i could ever do a pouch because this just it's it separates things so well and it just keeps me so unbelievably organized and having it in there and knowing it's so organized when I go to put something in my purse I feel like I'm compelled to put it back into the spot where it belongs versus just sort of 
throwing it in my bag so I, I don't know why that is uh, or you know what the whole compulsion is with that having that organizer in there but I can tell you um, it definitely keeps me far more organized and it keeps me wanting to be more organized and I just don't necessarily throw things in my bag anymore but yes I hope you guys really enjoyed that unfortunately the sale is no longer going on the Longchamp site. However, I will say that I was actually browsing the Nordstrom anniversary sale and they have a couple Longchamp Le Pliage bags and those are really cool because of the, um, they're expandable totes. So there's a zipper here and the bag goes longer. So I thought that was kind of fun. Uh, so definitely look out for that on the Nordstrom anniversary sale. But anyway, you guys, that is an, the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys go out and buy this organizer. I'm telling you, it is a game changer. If you do go buy it, let me know um, and tell me what you think of it. But anyway, until the next one, guys, remember life is short by the bag. I'll see you next time.